In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a silhouette effect from green screen footage. So let's get into it. So once you're inside of Adobe After Effects and you've got your green screen footage on your timeline, we first need to just begin by keying out the green. So we'll go into effects and presets. We'll search for key light. That is the keying plugin. We'll drop key light 1.2 onto our footage. Now from here, we're going to go into key light 1.2, go to screen color, use the eyedropper tool to select a green that is close to the person. Then we're going to change the view from final result to status. And as you can see, this key isn't the cleanest. You can see we've got gray on the subject and we've got black on the green screen. So we're just going to adjust the screen gain to try and get that background to more of a black and the subject to more of a white. So increasing the screen gain makes the green screen black and pulling the screen balance down makes the subject more white. Of course, feel free to adjust the clip black and the clip white to adjust this green screen as well. But this doesn't have to be perfect and I'll show you why in a second. So once you've got that roughly keyed out, we'll change the view back from status to final results. And then from here, we're just going to go up to the pen tool. So we go to the pen tool up here and we're just going to get rid of everything that isn't in the green screen. So as you can see, we've got this softbox light up here. We've got this harsh light back here. So we're just going to use the pen tool to get rid of all of that. We'll just mask inside the green screen. And now you can see we've got our subject on a transparent background. But the problem is if we zoom into the subject and we change the quality up to full so we can see what we're doing, you can see we've got all of this missing information from that key. It's pulled out some of the subject from that key. So we're going to go ahead and correct that now. So we're just going to select that layer. We'll go Command C, Command V. We'll go to the bottom layer. We'll select Track Mat, Alpha Mat, and then we'll go to that bottom layer and we'll delete the key light plugin. And that will really help to take that key to the next level and get rid of a lot of that ugly noise. Now from here, we're just going to select both of those layers. We'll right click, go to Precompose, and we'll call this Silhouette. Great. Now from here, we're just going to go into effects and presets, search for levels. Then we'll drop levels onto the silhouette layer. And then from here, you just want to pull the input black all the way up. So you can pull it all the way up until it's black. If it goes white, then you've gone a bit too far. Of course, feel free to adjust any of the other settings as well. Input white, you can pull the gamma down. The output black can stay the same or it can go down. And then once you're happy with the look of that, we can go ahead and create a new layer. So we'll go layer, new, solid. We'll go white or near white. Press OK. We'll drag that underneath. And there you go. As you can see, you've got your green screen footage now as a silhouette. Now, if you wanted to change the color of this silhouette from black to a different color, that's completely fine. We'll go into effects and presets again, and we're going to search for tint. We'll drop tint onto the silhouette layer and we'll go map black to select the black box and just select a color of your choice. So let's select this red or we can select a blue and that looks really awesome. And the great thing is because this silhouette layer is on a keyed layer because it's keyed out, there's no background. We can copy this a few times. We'll take this top layer, move it over. We'll take this middle layer and move that over. And of course, you can change the color of all of these different copies of the silhouette. So go to that top there. We'll change the blue to yellow. And there you go. You can see we've got three copies. They're all silhouettes and they're all completely different colors. And there you go. That is how you take your green screen footage in Adobe After Effects and turn that into a silhouette effect. Of course, you can also add the option of turning your silhouette into a colored silhouette by using the tint effect. But there you go. That is the tutorial now complete. So thank you ever so much for watching this video. I really do appreciate your support and hopefully I will see you on the next video. See you there.